Welcome to my Instagram. My name is Rowling. Today I'll be showing you how to center your hoop and trace your design. Your control panel has up two menus at the bottom of the screen. By selecting one of the arrows on either side, you can scroll through the menu and select your option. Select the icon with the needle and the red arrows going up and down. Now select the option that says move frame along design border. This will open a second window and give you two options on how to trace your design. The two options are called border check and outline check. The difference between a border check and an outline check is an outline check goes around the exact parameters of your design. The outline check comes in handy when embroidering on patches or difficult items like hats or something that you want to get particularly on the exact edge of. The border check checks the X and Y of the entire design. In this video, we are going to center a square hoop as well as a square hoop. Once you have hoop, both a circular and a square hoop, now let's enter the circular hoop first into the machine. This green key on your screen allows you to make a color change. Let's move your color change to needle number one. On a circular hoop, you have three screws. When needle number 11 lines up with the middle screw, it is perfectly centered with the machine. Move your frame by selecting the icon with the sash frame and arrows around it. Now let's center your square hoop. Your square hoop has two indicators on the top and bottom and on the left and right hand side. With your machine on needle number one, center it with the top indicator of your square hoop. Let's do the same for the indicators on the left and the right hand side of your square hoop. Thank you for watching. If this video helped you, please subscribe for us to make more videos like this.